Hello and welcome to this new tutorial. In this tutorial, we shall talk about the concept of ecology or ecologism. आप सबका स्वागत है इस नए tutorial में और आज के इस tutorial में हम लोग समझेंगे और जानेंगे the concept of ecology. तो फिर चलिए शुरू करते हैं the concept of ecology. Well, ecology is the study of relationship between living organism and their environment so when we talk about ecology it is basically a study of relationship between all the living organism and their intimate environment or their relations with the environment and this can be explained with this example or the image what we are right now witnessing or which right now you are seeing on your screen that we all living creatures or we all living organism are very much part of this environment and this is basically a relationship between we the people of earth as well as all the living creatures and environment so this is basically so ecology is basically a study of relationship between we all living creatures living organism and their environment jab hum ecology ki baat karte hain to ecology ek aisi study hai aur ye study basically ek relationship humko batati hai between all the living organism और जो एनवायरनमेंट है हमारा उसके बीच में अगर हम आम भाषा में या फिर एक सिंपल शब्दों में इनको कहें तो ये एक रिलेशनशिप है बिटवीन सारे जो ऑर्गेनिज्म है जैसे कि हम हैं बर्ड्स हैं एनिमल्स हैं और बहुत से बाकी स्पीशीज हैं सो ये जो रिलेशनशिप है ये इन लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म और उनका जो एनवायरनमेंट है इनका एक इनका एक रिलेशनशिप है सो बेसिकली इकोलॉजी इज द स्टडी ऑफ रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म एंड देयर एनवायरनमेंट। इट दस ड्रॉज अटेंशन टू नेटवर्क ऑफ रिलेशनशिप दैट सस्टेन ऑल फॉर्म्स ऑफ लाइफ एंड हाईलाइट्स द इंटरकनेक्टेडनेस ऑफ नेचर and therefore ecology can be regarded as a science a descriptive principle or even a moral value so therefore what ecology does that it draws an attention to understand this network of relationship which actually sustain all forms of life and it basically draws an attention to that interconnected nets of nature so basically what we need to understand here is that when we talk about ecology ecology basically talks about how today all the living creatures or all the forms of life are connected in fact are interconnected to this nature and therefore we all all living creatures we all living organism are sustained all forms of life because we are totally depending on the ecology and it is ecology which support all form of life so to understand in one line that organism cannot survive without the support of environment organism cannot sustain any form of a life if they are not supported by the nature and therefore our very existence depends on the ecology depends upon the environment around us depends upon how we are connected to the environment and therefore ecology today is regarded as a science or perhaps it can also be called as descriptive 
प्रिंसिपल्स और इवन मॉरल वैल्यूज यहाँ पर हमें एक बात बहुत इम्पॉर्टेंट समझनी है कि जो इकोलॉजी है ये बेसिकली एक नेटवर्क ऑफ रिलेशनशिप है जो सारे तरह के या फिर सारे फॉर्म ऑफ या सारे टाइप ऑफ जो लाइफ है उसको सस्टेन करती है और इसमें हर एक ऑर्गेनिज्म आता है हर एक पंछी आता है हर एक एनिमल आता है इसमें हम भी शामिल हैं और आज की तारीख में अगर हम देखेंगे कि जो ऑल सॉर्ट ऑफ लाइफ है या फिर एक फॉर्म्स ऑफ लाइफ है ये एक इंटरकनेक्टेड है नेचर से कहने का यही तात्पर्य है कि ऑल फॉर्म्स ऑफ लाइफ जो है आज हमारे दुनिया में ये सभी एनवायरनमेंट से कनेक्टेड है अगर एनवायरनमेंट नहीं है तो हम नहीं हैं तो इकोलॉजी जो है बेसिकली इट इज अ नेटवर्क ऑफ रिलेशनशिप दैट सस्टेन ऑल फॉर्म्स ऑफ लाइफ और इसीलिए हम सारे लोग हम सारे ऑर्गेनिज्म या फिर आप कहिए ऑल फॉर्म्स ऑफ ऑर्गेनिज्म आर पार्ट ऑफ दिस इकोलॉजी वी आर डिपेंडेड ऑन इच अदर वी आर इंटरकनेक्टेड विद दिस नेचर और इसीलिए हमारा जो अस्तित्व है ये नेचर के ऊपर डिपेंड है हम एक कंपोजिट नेचर में रहते हैं जहाँ पर हर एक ऑर्गेनिज्म को सपोर्ट किया गया है बाय इकोलॉजी एंड देफ वो ऑल रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन ऑर्गेनिज्म स्पेशली लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म कंप्राइज इकोलॉजी एंड देफ वो आज की तारीख में इकोलॉजी कैन बी रिगार्डेड एज अ साइंस एंड देफ वो वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस साइंस ऑफ रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन द एनवायरमेंट एंड लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म मूविंग फॉरवर्ड सो देफ वो हियर when we talk about ecologism now i'm moving towards ecologism okay earlier we discussed about ecology and now all about ecologism so ecologism is a political doctrine or a ideology that is constructed on the basis of ecological assumptions notably about the essential link between human kind and the natural world so therefore now we are talking about ecologism and why ecologism has become a very important debate because it is a political doctrine or an ideology that basically constructed the basic assumptions of ecologism and therefore in ecologism that is a political doctrine we have to understand the link between the human kind and the natural world so therefore humans are part of the nature and not its master and therefore we also have to remember here that we are part of this nature and as i have already spoken about it we are a part of a nature and we are not master and this is what happens when we play like a master and we try to underestimate ecologism and every time when man tried his best to become a master we have always have hampered our ecology and our environment so therefore ecologism sometimes distinguished from environmentalism ecologism implies the adoption of a biocentric or ecocentric perspective while later environmentalism concerned with protective nature ultimately for human benefit so therefore here what we need to understand is that ecologism is sometimes distinguished from environmentalism in that the former implies the adoption of biocentric or ecocentric perspective so when we talk about ecologism and when we talk about environmentalism so we need to understand that it is ecologism which implies the importance of a biocentric 
which talks about ecocentric perspective as exactly we have spoken about that ecological is basically a relationship between all the living creatures all the living organism and the environment so therefore ecologism adopts a very biocentric perspective whereas environmentalism is more concerned with the protecting nature and this nature is ultimately for the human benefits so let me repeat all over again that ecologism is all about understanding a biocentric perspective of importance of all the organism and their relationship with environment whereas environmentalism is basically is concerned with the protecting of nature only for a benefits of a human being or ultimately for a human benefit so this is a thin line which divides ecologism and environmentalism ecologism talks about in total of all the biodiversities in total about all the living organism in the environment whereas environmentalism talks about protecting the nature so this is all about the concept of ecology and ecologism so jab hum ecologism ki baat karte hain to ecologism ka jo concept hai ye basically ek biocentric concept hai aur is ecologism mein wo sari cheeze aati hai jitko hum living creatures kehte hain जिनको हम लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म कहते हैं और इकोलॉजिज्म बेसिकली उस बायोडाइवर्सिटी के ऊपर फोकस करता है कि उनको बचाना है वेर एज एनवायरमेंटलिज्म का जो कंसर्न है ये बेसिकली कहता है कि हमें पूरे एनवायरनमेंट को बचाना है इंसानों के लिए सो so ये जो थीन लाइन है बिटवीन इकोलॉजिज्म और एनवायरमेंटलिज्म के बीच में हमें समझनी है so this is all about the concept of ecology and ecologism i hope you have understood the concept of ecology and ecologism thank you very much for watching this tutorial and i will see you soon in next tutorial till then take care